Hello and welcome to the Clashing of Steel. So today I have something that I recorded a long while ago. I may have used it as an example maybe in one of my older videos, but it pretty much just shows how ranged players think. Not all of them of course, there are many that are very good at playing ranged units, but then there are guys like these javelins and slingers here. At first everything seems to be actually even somewhat fine. Slingers are running towards me, javelins aren't pushing too far out, and I'm also having the light artillery in front of my pikes. Even the opposing cavalry realizes he has to run, but because opponents are coming in with such huge numbers and heavy force, I need to pull back to a reasonable defensive location. Javelins here are just wasting time trying to hit the studo. They exposed themselves and well, I just couldn't reach to their defense in time, so... I was actually hoping for him to follow me back as the light artillery and the slingers did. But even slingers here think they are untouchable because they are in front of the pikemen. He could have just moved to the light artillery and harassed everybody from up there. As this cavalry charged in here, I was actually hoping for a lot of them to miss the slingers and perhaps even charge into my pikes. But instead, I'm inflicting a bit more friendly fire and perhaps doing a lot more harm than I'm doing anything good. This was like one of the worst actions by the ranged units. I could defend them if they would act rationally. But instead, they went too greedy and thought they could survive in front of me or slightly away from me. We could have probably held this area, we could have survived it rather well. But uh, as usually, the players get greedy, they don't think rationally. And this type of actions often enough just cost one team their chances at victory. Okay, so here's another match where my team member messes up. He accidentally activates Phalanx and pretty much wipes one of my units out. After that he realizes what he did and his overall motivation goes straight down. It happens right now and is really painful to watch. Just three units of spearmen in Phalanx and walking over one unit of archers. Well, technically two, but, well, the first one was the one who got hammered. Of course, mistakes can happen to anyone. But because of that, we actually missed our window. We are still trying to go for the watchtower and, well, we can't seal it off anymore because he was somewhat late to seal it off. And because of the low motivation, he also messes up his spear location and positioning. He does try to build me a small box here, right against this wall, but, uh, well, everything just goes to hell. When this happened, I just couldn't believe it. To be honest, he couldn't believe it either, but this can just show you how making a wrong move at the worst possible time can mess everything up. Well, for now, the friendly fire has been removed and the situation might have not happened, but it's fun to reminisce about the good old days. Well, I guess that players could learn from this that staying behind pikemen is the best option if you're a ranged unit, and that even spears might not be able to defend you if they mess up. Of course not that fatally anymore like it happened here, but still. So these were just some things that shouldn't have happened. But as you see, it can even happen to those players who know what they're doing. You just need to mess up at the right moment and everything might go south. Anyways, don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.